So what is up bosses, it's your boy Boss Fatbod and welcome to a game called Alba a Wildlife Adventure. So I'm going to go back and do what I used to do, which was if I saw a game that was relatively interesting, I would try it for a video. If it makes a video, it makes a video. If it doesn't make a video, then at least I've actually played the game and somewhat enjoyed it. So here we are. This is a random game I found on Steam. I have absolutely no idea what it's about, but let's see. Maybe it will turn out to be my favourite game of all time. You never know with these things. So we have a little bird, okay, that might be me, I have no idea, that's how much I know about the game, I don't even know the freaking character we play as. Or maybe we don't play as a character, maybe we're just us, like literally the narrator and then we just do things around. Or we're this little girl potentially, is this Albert, this is Albert, okay. We can turn the camera around, that's good. I already like this, the art style is really cool, we can move around, we can actually move the camera around, which usually you can't do in these type of games. One. What does one do? Oh, to-do list. Okay. I don't have anything to do. For some reason, there's no brightness settings as well. Like, my freaking... I've got a little mouse on the screen. Or, like, a little cursor, should I say. And it disappears on the to-do list. And there's no way of me, like, freaking turning down the brightness. Or at least just turning down the brightness there. Because in the game, as you can tell, the brightness is pretty much completely fine. Which I guess is why there's no brightness settings. Because there's not really a reason for you to need to turn the brightness. I actually can't go that way. So the only way to go is over this way. We turn the mouse sensitivity a tiny bit. So I can go left and right. I can't move up and... Oh, I can look up and down. It's just that's very weird. Okay, fair enough. Oh, wait, is this... Oh, this person I need to talk to, maybe? So shift is actually slowing down. I can't speed up anyway. I think because she's got like a freaking... Like a white circle on the top of her head. I think I talked to this person. Here we go. Grandma, where is my baby Albert? I'm right here, Grandma. Here you are, my ama, maybe. Always chasing birds. Speaking of bird lovers, Grandad finally returns. Look, he's behind you. This is a horror game now. Oh, Grandad, hello, buddy. Birds, can we freaking go away, please? I am very small, actually. Jesus Christ. Sorry, the distracted or got distracted back there. I thought I'd seen a glossy ibis in the nature reserve. I don't know what any of this means. Turned out to be a mere moor hen. Oh, what's that there? My two favourite humans. Oh, you were just talking to no one, apparently, then. Yeah, then you freaking realised that we were here. And then you took a picture of us. Great. That's brilliant. That one is for the album. Alas, the bane of the photographer is to never appear in pictures. Albert, Bonica, why don't you try... Take a picture of me. And uh, Abuela, maybe? Come over here, you can use my phone. Okay, great. You'll probably be able to do that, girl, seeing as though I'm about freaking one years old. Is that good? Or do I take the picture, right? Here you go, Alba. Please don't drop it. Let's drop it. I feel like that's exactly the sort of thing that I would do. Is that a freaking iPhone 12, potentially? Just point the phone and click the button. Try to get me and... I'm just going to stop saying it. I have no idea how to freaking put out. Try and get me and Amy. There we go, in the picture. That's your new name, girl. Okay, so I press 2. And then I... Let's zoom in properly. Or should we get a selfie? Should we get, should we zoom in as much as possible? And let's get, let's get, oh, I can't get both of them in focus, so I guess I'll just do that. Jesus, that was a freaking jarring right there. Oh, that's perfect. Exactly the freaking picture that I just took. Look, in the photo, an Iberian lynx here in the nature reserve. The king of the forest, what a magnificent creature. Okay. Alba's first photo, granddad king of the forest and grandma, just grandma. Grandad's king of the forest and grandma is just grandma. Literally just grandma. There's too many more summers together. Or here's too many more summers together. Lab, abuela, and someone. Oh, look, completed. Hell yes. That was very quick. Ten years later, Monday morning. Flight 319 LGW to VLC. I'm just glad it's not freaking Flight 180, to be honest. Wonder if anyone gets that freaking old school reference. Yeah, th this is a bit too bright. I guess for you guys, I can just turn down the brightness whenever it needs to be. Oh yes, where are we now then? I mean, it said like the freaking, like the three letters. Well, obviously, that's not the full name. I just hit one of the microphones and I was just like, oh, sorry, I just hit you. But that's another microphone that I just hit. I've got like freaking three microphones around me because I'm actually trying to sort them out and get them working. I've got like two really old mics. And then my actual mic I'm using is in front of me. Just a little bit freaking behind the scenes for you guys. Alba. 
So happy you're back for the week. Yes, we are. And don't forget the town festival is on Saturday. Okay, so that's in three days for me. Are you excited? Excited? Uh, I guess so, yeah. Nod, shake head. Oh, okay, great. Yes, I am. Oh, no. I'm not excited. Never mind. I am excited or I'm not? I don't know. Is that good? Don't worry. This time, we won't ask you to dance with us. At least not in front of the whole town. You must be hungry after your travels. Let's go to la something. The restaurant for lunch to celebrate your arrival. It's cool for boat to the restaurant. Children go free. Hell yes. We're a little early. The something won't be ready. Why don't you check out this island while Grandad and I chill? Wait, that reminds me. I have a gift for you. I have a gift for you. A wildlife guide. Here we go. I guess that's why it's called a wildlife adventure. I'm guessing like we, because we got a phone that I guess we're going to keep now. I guess we go around and just like take pictures of people, I guess. Or like animals. Did we see an insect and stuff like that? The guide lists all the wildlife you can find around here. Remember the Liberian lynx? Yes. I do. I do remember him. I knew you'd remember. I wish we could go and look for one together this week. That's cool that you can actually nod and shake as well. That's cool that you can actually do that. Uh, but sadly, they are practically extinct these days. We saw one and we actually, we did get a picture of it. Apparently, my freaking selfie of just Nan and Grandad's head had one of them freaking... The, what are they, like the fox or whatever? I can't even remember what they freaking are now. Uh, you're something, or Grandad, I guess, is right. No chance finding one now. But maybe you'll spot some dolphins. Hell yes. Now go explore. We'll text you when lunch is ready. I guess we do keep the phone then. Can I go in the water? I can't. Never mind. Oh wait, I'm actually... I'm skipping now. Okay, I don't know how I did that. Oh, I'm chasing a bird. Buddy! Can I... Uh, what, one and four? What's four? Four is this. On the beach. Okay. Rare. And I can do this stuff. So I guess do I have to like listen out for that sound then potentially? What have I got on the beach? I have got nothing on the beach. Fantastic. I've got this guy. What's one then? One says to do. Okay. So I don't have a phone anymore then. So do I keep freaking pressing shift because I think I'm going to freaking sprint. Let me talk to this guy here. Alba. Yes. Dude, you're back. It's me, something, your best friend or bestest friend. Did you miss me? Of course you did. It's been like a year. I counted. Come on, let me show you around. Okay, I guess we're doing this now. Hello, buddy. Let's go. I can't sprint anymore or freaking skip anymore for some reason. Is this your dad, maybe? Look who's back, cousin Pepe or cousin. Alba, you've grown so much since last year. We're going to go explore the island back later. Oh, we're... Okay, we are, I guess. Awesome. Let's do it. Follow Eden's, I guess, to the ancient ruins, or Inez. These are very freaking hard words slash names to pronounce. Right, so we got another thing in the to-do, I guess. Yeah, that's just that thing. Awesome. So I don't take pictures of these guys. There's a freaking red squirrel right there. I've never really seen one of them in freaking real life before. Right, what have we got here? These ancient ruins are, like, very broken. Four favourite ruins. Wait. What's that noise? That freaking bird that just came out of the freaking sky. Is that a dolphin? Oh no, look. There's a stranded dolphin. Come on, down to the beast. The dolphin needs our help. That's great, because that's the first thing that I need in my book, so that's perfect. Oh wait, dolphin... Does that keep... Oh wait, continue. What? Okay, that's... Oh, that's just the main menu. What the hell? Um... I seem to have broken the game. Okay, I loaded up the game again and it's all good. That was very weird. I kind of, I pressed one, but the game thought that I pressed escape maybe and then loaded up the freaking journal and the main menu at the same time. And then I let go and I guess when you go into that journal, it gets rid of your character. So then like the freaking camera doesn't clip through you, essentially, which is what a lot of games do. I didn't do it then. The dolphin's trapped in a net. We gotta rescue it quickly. It's too heavy and need more people. I'm going to deal with this net. You get more help. Surely they can freaking hear it though, right? We got this. I've got to be freaking careful when doing that now. So yeah, right now our character model isn't actually there. The dolphin rescue. Find people to help save the dolphin. we got six people to find. Okay, can I pick up this stuff as well? I can't. Actually, he's not moving quite quickly as well. Look at that. Jesus. All right, let's go. 
We got people over here. I guess everyone with the freaking circle on top of their head. Suggests that they can actually help us, potentially. Buddy, could you help me, please? A dolphin stranded? Yes, you just guessed that, apparently, did you? So no more. I'll see you there. I can do chores, apparently. That's great. Hell yes. So I guess I'd do that, and then that person would like me more, potentially? So yeah, I guess I can do chores like that, and then that person would like me more. And then they're more obliged to actually help me when I ask them to, I guess. There we go. Or maybe that means the bin likes me more. Who knows? Oh, we go. Is this mum and dad? I actually can't remember. Stranded dolphin. Yeah, here. Oh, uh, nana granddad even. Let's go. There's both of them. Run up everyone to chip in. Dolphins weigh a ton. Okay, we're just doing this now then, I guess. A dolphin was ashore. Of course I'll help. Am I actually telling them or do they just freaking know? I guess because it's a game, they just know, right? They're freaking programmed to know. A dolphin? On my way. The something can wait. So that's a uh, thingy's, uh, whatever, the cousin, right? I don't remember their freaking names, because their names aren't English. I'm never going to remember their names. Dolphin Rescue Operation. I'm live streaming that. Maybe not. Maybe not the freaking best thing to live stream, actually. Just in case something else freaking happens. All right, return the dolphin to sea. Let's do it. Apparently, this is exactly the amount of freaking people that we need. Two really freaking small girls. A nan and a granddad. An old, two more old guys, and one guy that seems like he can actually do it by himself. Perfect. Let's all chip in now, shall we? Well, me and this other girl do absolutely nothing to help. There you go, buddy. Hell yes. You went in and saved the dolphin's life. Look, the dolphin is saying thanks. Are we going to get it? Yeah, there we go. Perfect photo opportunity. Let's do it. Then maybe we can put it in our journal as well. Hell yes. Bit sad that I couldn't do that freaking picture. Albert, Albert fam. Okay, doing freaking slang are we in this game? Our purpose in life is going to hit you hard, man. Ready for it? Albert and Innes. Wildlife Rescue League. The AIWRL. Okay, Nate needs a brainstorm. Yes, definitely. The goal remains. The wildlife is now under our protection. We have this. Well, we got this. Oh yes, Girl Stars of Wildlife League. And about 30 lines with no text on it. Come on, wildlife rescuers, let's head home. I guess that's the end then. Well, not the end of the freaking game, because I know it's about two, two and a half hours long. This video isn't going to be freaking two, two and a half hours long though. I'm only going to be playing a bit of it. But then that's, that's good, because stuff like Memories Retold, if I never did the first episode, then I wouldn't have known how good the game was. I always need to say this is going to be a one-off episode or a one-off video of this game I have no idea about. If I really enjoy it, then it will become a series. There we go. Day one completed. Tuesday, signs of change. I guess I'll do day two and then I'll be this video done. Or do I need to click? I, I guess I do need to click. I never know because I, as soon as I click or freaking press something on the controller, it goes, it transitions straight away. I still have no idea. Did I do that or did the game just suddenly say, oh, let's freaking transition exactly the same time that this guy does something. Here we go. I guess this is our house then. Morning, Alba. Hope you slept well after all that excitement yesterday. And granddad, shh. Hey, morning, Alba. Sorry. Ah, yes. We have to keep it down. You're a, you're a brulo who is trying to snap birds. I have no idea. He hasn't had much luck this morning. Hmm, why aren't there any birds? Ah, there's no bird food, that's why. And you've stuck two pencils in it, that might be why as well. Albert, do you mind filling up the bird feeder for me, please? Yeah, I don't think they eat pencils. Pretty sure that's not what freaking birds eat. I need to be ready to take photos at a moment's notice. Oh, do we have the... Let me check, do I have the actual... Or four? Do we have... I don't have it. Brilliant. I don't have a freaking common dolphin. Even though we literally freaking rescued one, I still don't have that in the journal, apparently. But there we go. Of it. Then the birds love us now. Uh, granddad, I guess. We've got birds. Let's check them out, Albert. Here, have my old phone. It has the Wildlife Guard Companion app, or Guide Companion app. Oh, yes. Old phone looks exactly the same as freaking granddad's. Now, just point, click, and identify. Try it with the birds on the feeder. So now we do it. Okay, fair enough. I guess we keep this phone now. And identify it. Okay, that's cool. New animal found. Hell yes. 
a zero to save? Is that literally an O to save? Is that... Is. Okay, fair enough. That's done. Identifying. This will save them all as well, so we can actually keep them. House Sparrow, uh, Pacer or Passer, Domesticus, Common, Done. Okay, perfect. And what about this up here? This random freaking guy's house, potentially. Did you find out what bird it is? Uh, yes. Yes, I did. That's cheating. I saw you using an app. How else would I freaking know, though? It's a great app, and it works on all animals, not just birds. So it works on you as well, because we're animals. Human beings are, in fact, animals. You can go and explore now, have fun scanning animals. Oh, yes. So it kind of is just an open world now, which is cool. I can't jump there, unfortunately. Oh, okay, I can leave here. Oh, but I almost forgot. Take this map so you don't get lost. Have fun. It's a literal map. Why didn't you freaking just give me Google Maps on your phone, girl? Jesus Christ. All right, what have we got around here? Can I literally... Can I take pictures of humans? And that would count? Hello, girl. I'm just randomly in your house or next to your house. I can't... Okay, you're not an animal, apparently. All right, what else have we got around here? It kind of reminds me of another game. I can't remember what other game I played where you actually go around and just take pictures of stuff. Oh, I need to... Okay, I need to be careful with these guys then. Right, uh, that's perfect, apparently. Awesome. That's amazing. I right, save and then identify. Perfect picture right there. That explains why shift is a slow walk, so then you don't actually interfere with the animals and they don't run away from you. There we go. So that and then E, and I believe I got a freaking message from Grandad then. Or just whoever that was. Oh, uh, great. Brilliant. Not gonna say that. Uh, people of Sicaro come to the nature reserve something. But can I not just... I can't just go on my phone normally. Oh, wait, do I have this guy? Is that the same one? Oh, that is the same one. Okay, fair enough. That's cool as well how it just shows you this the same one. Let's do that as well. Do all of that. Hell yes. I don't know what that does yet, but I guess that's good to do. Where's this? I just saw another guy, didn't I? Are you all the same? Oh, we have this guy. Is that a cat, potentially? A new animal found. Oh, an E. Then this might be a cat. Domestic cat. Hell yes. And is that five now, I believe? Was that four, potentially? There's more rubbish over there to deal with. It's actually a really good game. I could, I could see myself just playing the, like, the crap out of this in my spare time. This is exactly the sort of game that I love. I don't know why I say that every time I freaking play a new game. But it literally is. Just going around and... Okay, that's the wrong button. Just going around and just fixing stuff. Which is what I do in real life anyway. Like, if I just see something on the floor, just rubbish, I pick it up put it in the bin. It's exactly what I'm freaking doing in this game. See some rubbish on the floor, pick it up put it in the bin. Part of it. The world would be a lot better if everyone did that, but unfortunately, not everyone does. Which in some cases, like that freaking Futurama episode, it actually helped them. This guy is new, right? Oh no, I, I did just get a pigeon. Okay, fair enough. Well, this cat, this cat is new. Okay, wrong button again. Oh, can I? Okay, I'm pressing the wrong button again. Brilliant. Well, that is just the same. Okay, fair enough. Well, you're, you're sick. Okay, let's stay away from you, mate. For no reason at all, let's stay away from someone that's sick. Oh, I can do this as well. Do some random person's laundry. Fantastic. They're probably going to think they've been robbed now if they don't freaking look in the bag first. All right, what we go around here? Can I do anything with these signs? Okay, I can't. So what, what have we got now? Well, that's just saying that I've got new stuff, apparently. It's this that's new, right? Yeah, here we go. We've got you now. So it's actually me taking pictures of stuff, then it gets put in there. So we got... So that's the map there. Okay, fair enough. I don't really need that right now because I haven't really been anywhere yet at the moment. Just been staying around the same area. Yeah, that's right there. I guess we'll go down here to the beach. I kind of want to get a dolphin. I really want to get a dolphin. I thought like that would be really cool. We turn the radio on here. There we go, perfect. Perfect tunes right there. All right, what can we get on the beach? Any sea creatures at all? Anything, literally anything, any fins at all. We have a seagull over here. I don't have a seagull yet, I don't think. Because we can get this guy now. Too small and perfect. A seagull with a massive head for some reason. I don't remember seagull's heads being freaking circular before. A lesser black backed uh, gull. Yeah, that's, that's how you say that. I guess all of these guys are the same then. I really want to see something in the water though. So can I just not go into the water then? I can. 
Oh, no, I can't. Okay, I can go there. Well, here we can go right into the forest, or just a little miniature forest, I guess. So this might have some stuff that we don't have yet. I just, I just want to get, like, one or two more, and then I'll be happy with this video. This game's been quite good, though, hasn't it? This game has actually been really enjoyable. Well, let's get this guy. This is a squirrel-type thing, I believe. Oh, is that a... I actually don't know what that is, but I can't go off this log, so I've got to go like that. And then, I don't know what this is. It's unidentified, so I guess I should know what it is, and that's actually not a good enough picture. There we go. And save, and is this guy? Is this bird one that I don't have? I didn't... what? There. Do animal found, there we go. I think I freaking failed twice then. And that's a red squirrel, perfect. Right, let's get one more, and then I will end this episode. So what have we got around here? We see here, this just shows us what's in the area. Okay. So I've got you, and I've got... So I've got three of these. It's just this blue bird here that I'm pretty sure is that one there. So I've got them two. Is this... Oh, wait, there's a there's a rabbit. You're amazing. Identify. Hell yes. Zero and E, or O and E. There we go. European rabbit. Parvit. On that note, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to end my video on Alba, a wildlife adventure, I believe is what the game's called. This game is amazing. This game is very freaking chill and is exactly the sort of game that I would just freaking lie in my bed playing the absolute crap of for freaking hours a day. Well, that, ladies and gentlemen, as I've said, is going to end my video on Albert, a wildlife adventure. As usual, there'll be a link in the description if you want to help yourself. But for now, hopefully you've enjoyed. Please leave a like if you did. Subscribe for our brand new and it's been your boy, Boss Fat One. Thanks for watching and of course, as always, peace.